Welcome to another session from Learn How to Reason. My name is Matt. This is the third part in my e-drumming in Reason drum series. And today I'm going to go over e-drumming with Kong, the Kong drum designer. You know, I love the Kong drum designer. Uh, you know, I hear a lot of people talking about the Kong drum designer. And it seems that everybody thinks it's a, uh, a hip-hop, bebop, MPC type of drum machine. And it's so far away from that, it's ridiculous. It's a drum... It, 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 what it is is a drum designer named Kong. And that means you can design your own drum sounds for any genre of music and you can sample any sound on the planet Earth. It is a drum designing beast. But today what I'm gonna do is uh, I took the stock default kit and I made some changes to it, not much. And I'm gonna, I, 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 you know, uh, hooked it up to my, my e-kit and uh, you can see here I have it routed out to the to the SL SSL mixer because I you know I like to have all my my drum kits mapped out this way so you can uh, control the sound better. Um, and what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to put these uh, song files up for you guys to download if you would like, and it's. Uh, you just open up the it's a it's a reason six you know song file but if you open it up you can have in this one you'd have the kong all wired up ready to go you just create your own sounds and everything and it's all mapped out and if you want to make a couple changes it's there and you can look at everything and see how it's wired up you know much easier than uh, showing you just download it use it so what i did is i I laid down this little, uh, check this out, I laid down this little uh, piano riff with my, oh where is it, oh here it is, with the combinator I made, oh yeah, I just threw those together, no problem. Um, what, uh, what we're going to do though is we're going to pan these guys, let's pan these guys way this way, get that one in the middle. And then kind of like this. This gives a big piano sound. Eh, it's easy to do. But so this is what we have uh, so far. <laughs> say we put some drums to that using the Kong drum designer playing it on the e-kit check it out
we just lay down some cool drums using the Kong drum designer and the e-kit. And when we were, you know, I'm sure you heard some double triggers in there. Just double click, click on this. You can see the bass drum right there, snare. We can go in there and easily fix them. We can see some triples and stuff like that. Those are where, the, where it happened. But it's easy to fix. You know, if you know reason, you know how to edit. It's not hard. But the whole thing here is this. You can use an e-kit to do your drumming in Reason. And the next one I'll do, uh, I'm going to get the, the e-kit triggering a redrum next. And if you go here to the Learn How to Reason website, you'll see right here at the top, e-drumming. You can go right in here, ask questions. I'll be happy to answer them. So until next time, rock on. Get those e-kits or triggers hooked up to the Kong or the, the NNXT and start playing them like a drum set should be played. Take care, everybody.